Get ready to embark on a whimsical adventure with Tiny Tales. Subscribe now and let the storytelling begin. Once upon a time, in a cozy little cottage nestled amidst rolling hills and whispering trees, there lived an old woman and her husband. The couple led a simple life, finding joy in each other's company and the little pleasures of everyday living. One bright morning, as the sun cast its golden rays upon the cottage, the old woman decided to bake something special. She dusted off her recipe book and gathered flour, sugar, spices, and molasses, setting to work on creating a batch of delicious gingerbread dough. With practiced hands, she rolled out the dough and carefully cut it into the shape of a little man, giving him raisin eyes and a smile made of frosting. As she placed the gingerbread man into the oven to bake, a magical spark danced through the air, infusing the little cookie with life. With a sudden burst of energy, the gingerbread man sprang to life, leaping from the baking tray and darting out of the open window, shouting, run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. The old woman and her husband watched in amazement as the gingerbread man dashed across the yard, his tiny legs carrying him with remarkable speed. Determined to capture their lively creation, they set off in hot pursuit, calling out to him to stop. But the gingerbread man paid no heed, laughing and taunting them as he ran. Through fields of wheat and meadows of flowers he sped, his infectious laughter ringing through the air. Along the way, he encountered various animals, a curious cow, a playful pig, and a cunning fox each eager to catch him for a tasty snack. But the gingerbread man was too quick and clever for them, always staying one step ahead with his catchy rhyme. He danced out of reach of the cow's outstretched tongue, evaded the pig's clumsy attempts to grab him, and outwitted the fox's sly tricks. As he ran, the gingerbread man's confidence swelled, his little heart filled with the exhilaration of freedom. He believed himself invincible, untouchable, destined to outrun any who dared to catch him. But as he reached the edge of a wide river, his jubilation turned to uncertainty. The rushing waters stretched out before him, a formidable barrier blocking his path. For the first time, doubt crept into the gingerbread man's mind, his carefree spirit faltering as he pondered his next move. Just then, the sly fox appeared once more, his eyes gleaming with cunning. Dear gingerbread man, he said with a sly smile, I can't catch you, but I can help you cross the river. Hop on my back, and I'll take you to safety. Though hesitant, the gingerbread man saw no other option and reluctantly agreed. With a leap, he landed on the fox's back, clinging tightly as they ventured into the swirling waters. But as they reached the middle of the river, the fox's true intentions were revealed. With a swift flick of his tail, he tossed the gingerbread man into the air, catching him in his jaws with a single snap. And just like that, the lively cookie was gone, devoured in one swift bite. As the old woman and her husband arrived at the riverbank, they gazed out at the churning waters, their hearts heavy with disappointment. Though their creation had met a tragic end, they found solace in the memories of his brief, spirited existence. And so, the tale of the gingerbread man came to a close, a cautionary reminder of the perils of arrogance and the importance of humility. Though he had run as fast as he could, in the end, he learned that even the swiftest runner could not outrun fate.